what up, world? So I'm, I'm coming at y'all because I want to review this Common album, Nobody Smiling. It's Common's 10th album, man. Can, can y'all believe that shit, man? Uh, dude has been making music for 22 years, man. Uh, can I Borrow a Dollar came out in, in 1992. And um, me, I'll admit it. I know a lot of motherfuckers won't, but I'll admit that I jumped on Common Bandwagon when B came out, man. B is one of the best albums of, of the 2000s. And then, along with Find It Forever, Universal Mind Control, um, The Dream of the Believer, our comment has not put out no no whack shit since 2005. Um, I have his old stuff. I really need to go through his old stuff. I've, I've heard some of it, but I just need to revisit it. Um, but I believe the singles are, are Kingdom, um, Speak My Peace, and Diamonds. The, the whole album is entirely produced by No ID. All 10 tracks is real a real tight album. 10 tracks straight to the point. Um, and he's talking he's talking to Chicago, man. He uh he he wrote a love letter to his hometown basically like like this this is where Chicago is slipping. This is how Chicago can get better. And Along with the songs, man, he does all different type of variations, man. He does some conscious shit, of course. He does, you know what I'm saying, his one, two tracks to the ladies. He, he's got the feel-good tracks. He's got the tracks talking about his past. Um, just, man, Common, man. Common is one of the dopest artists in hip-hop right now, man. Um, lyricism ain't even a topic, man, because you know Common is always spitting. Um... And then, like I said, man, entirely produced by No ID. All the beats are dope as hell. Um, so I, I can't, I can't even pick a standout track, man. The sample on "Speak My Peace" is is so fucking dope. And then the way he just comes in on the neighborhood, man. The neighborhood is dope. Um, aside from Big Sean feature, Diamonds is dope. Hustle harder. Real got Elijah Blake on it rewind that i love rewind that how he was talking about how he came up and when he made b which you know what I'm saying like i said is critically acclaimed everybody says it's one of his best albums ever if not his best album ever no id wasn't on it and he was talking about how he regret not having no id on that shit and uh just introspective shit man like it's just it's it's no skippers in my opinion 10 songs no skippers the, the the only knock, man. The, the, there's not really there's not really a standout feature. I don't think any feature was really like like oh my goodness, I gotta rewind that shit. And that's what track ten is called. Rewind that. I'm not like um, Big Sean is on diamonds. Big Sean, Big Sean, like I was talking to my boy about this shit the other day, man. Big Sean had mad potential to be one of the next generation of of dope motherfuckers and big sean popularity he bases that shit off his sound effects like his delivery ain't even tight no more um he run just basic ass dr seuss a a a shit like that and he like he got a couple lines on that track that on diamonds that i was like okay okay i see you but overall like the verse wasn't that tight what's her name um jenny janae a cool or whatever her name is um her verse was cool but uh, like I said, nothing that I'm gonna revisit because of her. Um, like nobody, no feature. Elijah Blake got the chorus on on real. Vince Staples is on Kingdom. Um, like Common, like didn't get anybody on this album that's gonna steal the spotlight from him. Uh, like the features is the only problem. Like Common lyricism, production, the content that the overall album is talking about. Like it's all dope. So. um... I mean, in my opinion, man, nobody smiling is a dope album. If you if you a common fan, you gotta pick this shit up. Um, and I, I hope he drops another album before two and a half, three years from now. This is only like my third or fourth album review of the year. So, I mean, I, I I'm not gonna I'm not gonna drop a favorite albums of summer video because this is pointless, man. I bought the Roots, I bought Fifty Cent, and I bought this Common. This Common is my favorite album of the summer. And man, like, there's so many rumored release dates, man. Uh, Game, Fifty Cent, Lupe Fiasco, uh, Big Crit, Kendrick Lamar. I just, um, I don't know when I'm gonna buy another album, man. 
So uh, stay tuned to my shit, man. I hope y'all like my flows. Um, check out my movie reviews. Check out all of that shit, man. Um, y'all know where to find me, man. Peace.